dawn, and as the sun breaks through the piercing chill of night on the plain outside Coram, it lights up a biblical famine. My name is Tasfasi Andalalo. Uh, 1984, October, I was uh, uh, in New Zealand with World Vision. Uh, the BBC news broke as I, was, as I came home from work and taking off my jacket, getting ready for dinner, turned on t t the TV, and the first thing was uh, Tigray and uh, Wallo and uh, so much for the dinner. We forgot completely. I, my wife was crying, I was crying. The next day I went to work, and there was a telex from World Vision asking me uh, to come back to Ethiopia. The most difficult thing that I can never forget in my life is that to go into the camp and choose from make, make a choice of those young children, lactating mothers and elderly people who should go into the uh, feeding ration, uh, the feeding camp. I will never forget that. All the eyes of the mothers were on you, uh, moving with wherever you are going, and the children, infants, open their mouth and the gasping, and from that you have to make a choice. It was the most horrible uh, situation. Uh, that, to me, uh, it, it still, when I think about it, it gives me a, a nightmare. It was terrible. Um, I'm hopeful that we will not, we'll never see that kind of famine in Ethiopia again. I am confident that we can manage it if, if it comes, if it comes, because there are, there's more infrastructure now available and more communication uh, doors are open and people know what to do and when to do. And so therefore, I'm very hopeful and very, very, very confident.